You're looking at thousands of years of erosion. Rocks pounding against rocks to form small craters. 1,185 holes cover this outcropping of marbleized limestone. They weren't formed naturally. They were made by the Miwok people. Miwok means people. Today, this sacred place is known as Indian Grinding Rock State Park. But interpreter Leticia Cordova says her Miwok ancestors have a different name for it. We know this park as Chase. The Chase is a large communal mortar in the ground where the Miwok would use stones to grind up and process acorns. And that would make what we call a nupa. So that's the acorn soup. Acorn harvest happens around September, and it's called the big time. It would bring different bands of the Miwok from the Bay Area and Sacramento Valley here. It's like being home, because I've been coming here since before I was born. Over at the Roundhouse, this is where ceremonies and marriages would take place. A lot of the land is where a lot of natives were at one point and lived in peace. Today, this land no longer belongs to the Miwok tribe. Gold miners and early settlers claimed the land and forced Native Americans off it. Maybe someday it'll be returned to the tribe, but for now, the Miwok culture is preserved in the state park so that we can all reflect on what was taken from them. For people to come here and be able to see this, and they've seen that we are still here, that we still have some of our culture left. From the Chasse at Indian Grinding Rock State Park, I'm John Bartell. Hope to see you on the back road.